after after a year worth of having the tire lettering, it's it still is good on the car. <laughs> Welcome back to another video. Anyway, y'all see by the thumbnail, we are gonna review this tire letter a whole year later. You know, the ups and downs of tire lettering and just my uh, overall review on tire lettering themselves. And is it worth it, man? So, uh, but before I get the video started, make sure y'all give me a like, subscribe, and comment. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate y'all for uh, killing it on the last tire lettering video. If y'all ain't seen it, make sure y'all, I'll pop it up somewhere up here. So make sure y'all go watch it. Um, but yeah, man, so uh, I, I just want to give y'all a, you know, just a quick review. This, probably, this video probably won't be too long, but uh, I'm definitely going to give y'all a review of the tire lettering a year later. You know, is it worth it? Is it still holding up? And everything like that so uh let's get this video started baby and um let's get into it baby but i gotta move my car first <laughs> make sure y'all don't follow me on instagram make sure y'all follow your boy on instagram you know what i'm saying uh there it is oh anyway uh let me move my car real quick all right y'all had to bring the car to the front look at that thing right there fool i need to go ahead and get that, get that thing clean of course, it's windy right now, so my fault, y'all. Um, but anyway, you know what I'm saying? That go the car. You know what I'm saying? Y'all seen it with the tire letter on. That's what it looked like a whole year later. Uh, so, you know, it's still, my opinion, it still holds up pretty good. It looked clean on camera, but, you know, you know, it's pretty, uh, it's kind of dirty. Just on some tires, though. Cer certain tires. It's uh, it's dirty, but other than that, after a whole year's worth of work, or after a whole year, it's still clean. I'm gonna do a uh, like a full in-depth review right now, so uh, so y'all can see uh, what it looks like or whatever, and then uh, like up close, so y'all can see the dirt from like how I showed y'all. But uh, y'all y'all gonna see it right now. But um, let's get into let's do the cons first of tire letter. All right, so this is the tire lettering a year later. I don't know if y'all can see that, but yeah, it's definitely some uh, some wear and tear on it. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, it's not too bad. You know, sometimes if you get the cleaning stuff that they that they send with your tire lettering, um, you know, they can uh, or it, uh. The stuff that they send with your tire lettering can clean it. If you run out, um, you can definitely order some more. Sorry for the wind if it's windy. Um, but you can definitely order some more from uh, tirestickers.com. Um, another thing is, sometimes the glue, they do send you an extra thing of glue. So, the glue needs to, I need to put some glue on that. Or if you can go to AutoZone, get like some, maybe like, just maybe like some little super glue or whatever. Maybe you can do it, but you know, I don't know how accurate that may be. So don't quote me on that. <laughs> uh, but yeah, man, um, a whole year later, um, I honestly still think they look good. Um, but we talking about the cons right now, um, but the cons, they definitely get dirty quick. Um, it's hard to see, but um, they definitely get dirty quick. Trying to get that for y'all, but that's only because. Hold on. But that's only because I have white tire lettering. So if anybody got color tire lettering, so maybe it it won't look as dirty, you know, as bad. But if you do a lot of burnouts, I'm pretty sure they're gonna look, you know, pretty bad. Um, another thing is, um, if you if you get white, like I said, they get dirty. They kind of they kind of turn yellow, but. You know, after a year worth of, like I said, after a year worth of having the tire lettering, it's, it still is good on the car. Dirty or not, like, tire lettering really makes your car stand out and uh, makes it different from everything. So, 
you know and this side is more dirtier than the other side so um you know it's, you, you got you guys can see it from back here just a little bit but also um now my house is you know like the parking area is full of dirt so you know what i'm saying that doesn't help my tire lettering at all um another con to uh tire lettering is um the maintenance like like i said they get dirty real quick so trying to keep them clean is a pain in the butt but uh if you really want your car to look good you get ready for car shows you know sometimes the the stuff that they send you um helps you know quick wipe down but if it's dirty it's dirty and sometimes it just makes you want to get all new tire lettering you know uh so you know so just keep that in mind when when getting uh tire lettering um but you know like i said even though it's dirty it's still pretty good you know it looks pretty good i just i just need to wipe them down um once you run out like i said you can still order some more stuff from um from tirestickers.com I'm not sponsored, <laughs> not yet anyway, speaking into existence, but I'm not sponsored, but uh, definitely, uh, you know, you know, they'll definitely send you another bottle or cleaning, cleaning case of tire, uh, or the tire lettering uh, cleaning solution. So definitely get your tire stickers from tire, to, from uh, get your tire lettering from tirestickers.com. Once again, this is not sponsored. <laughs> um, but yeah like but this side for some reason this side is way cleaner than the other side also um i'm thinking about doing a video i'm gonna go ahead and spoil it for y'all i'm gonna go ahead, i'm thinking about doing a video of me actually driving to tirestickers.com out in california and uh getting all new tire lettering because uh i got some crazy ideas and uh, i definitely want them to do it um you know what i'm saying so having some you know but uh, as y'all can see, that's that tire right there. This is the passenger tire, um, passenger front tire, and now my passenger back tire. <laughs> I had a little boo boo right here, <laughs> and I, you know, kind of scraped right there too. Had a little boo boo coming out of Taco Bell, and you know, <laughs> had a little accident. I know how to drive, you know. I, you know, knock on wood, I haven't had no major accidents, but you know, sometimes even even the best drivers scrape the curb a little bit. So I definitely hit the curb, you know, and uh, sorry if it's windy, but uh, I definitely hit the curb and uh, messed up my tire lettering just a little bit. But that's the only one. But also, you can get you can also reorder if you need specific letters, you can also reorder um, the letter. Or a couple letters it's literally like maybe a couple bucks few bucks you know pay for shipping and all that from tirestickers.com so um i'll leave the link below for tirestickers.com once again this video is not sponsored by tire stickers but yeah so um sorry for it's windy um but yeah like i said so the, so let me let me kind of recap i'm kind of i'm kind of going all over the place with this but um the cons of um tire tires tire lettering is it gets dirty quick uh it's it's a lot of maintenance or if you don't want to do a lot of maintenance for you know about like as far as cleaning them and keeping them clean and all this other stuff then don't get tire tire lettering don't get it because it, 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 it it's a headache you know um i had to find out the hard way but i'm happy in my investment but uh yeah so those are the cons of it um another con i don't think there's anything just keep just make sure um like once you run out of the stuff then you know you got to order and all all that stuff again so, but but my pros of tire lettering is no matter no whether if it's clean or dirty um the tire lettering is going to bring out your car no matter what it's you know it's crazy you know um, like I said after a year later you know my tie letter still looks good dirty or not you know I, but like I said I I'm definitely want to get some more I got to get that the um, the old part of sub-zero <laughs> oh <laughs> I got to get that part clean oh I'm sorry replace and um, yeah man um, is it worth it is tire lettering worth it yes yes it is no matter how, to me 
uh, it's, uh, uh, no matter how much the maintenance is and and how much you got to keep them clean that's just another reason for you to go to the car wash and wash your car you know uh so it's definitely worth it to me uh, so to keep your car clean to keep you keep you updated or keep your car updated looking clean all the time because you want to keep your because you want to keep your tire letter and clean you know what i'm saying so so uh so it's definitely worth it in that aspect to me also um it looks good like i said cleaning and dirty i know i keep saying that but like i'm telling you my car has been dirty my car is dirty right now and it still turns heads because of the tire lettering that's on there like, people want to read it and stuff but sometimes it's kind of embarrassing because my tire lettering is dirty or they look at the other side and you know it's it's messed up but it's all good it still brings out the car it turns head so would i recommend tire lettering to you for somebody who's looking to get tire lettering yes i would so definitely purchase them like i said the link is going to be below uh once again this video is not sponsored so make sure y'all go to tirestickers.com and get your tire lettering um you could do it yourself or you can have somebody do it um so you know do the gracious you know what i'm saying Ooh, to the most high i want to drive all the way to california and get new tire stickers or tire lettering for my car so stay tuned for that video uh, like I said, I'm trying not to make this a long video. Um, if y'all need to um, ask me more questions about the tie lettering, um, drop, you know, hit me down in the comments. You know, make sure y'all give me a like, subscribe, and comment on top of that. Um, and I'll answer any type of questions you guys need. Um, but yeah, definitely the maintenance. Keep that updated as far as the tire lettering. Keep them clean as much as you can. Um, but it's, it's not that hard to clean them. But I'm actually go to tirestickers.com. I'm actually go to the to the place. You know, and then when that do happen, we're going to get it in, man. So, appreciate y'all for tuning in. Watch this review. Um, yes, it's worth it. You know what I'm saying? What's going on, man? What's going on? Um, so, um, so, definitely get it done. And uh, get your tire, get your tire lettering from tirestickers.com. It's the only place to get them at. You know what I'm saying? And I honestly feel like I, kind of, I was like one of the first ones in Arizona to really have the tire lettering. And on their car and stuff and you know then after i did that then it kind of just took off you know what i'm saying so i was like yeah i started something i feel like i didn't start it but you know i feel like i had to do that for my car because it looked crazy anyway man make sure y'all like subscribe and comment you know what i'm saying give your boy a like um like i said any more questions about tyler and just let me know um hopefully it's not too windy in this video but uh that's the end of the video make sure y'all stay tuned uh rap coming soon uh, shut up i'm not gonna shut up anyway uh and um, appreciate y'all for tuning in. Um, like I said, like, subscribe, and comment. Um, any questions on tire lettering, hit me in my inbox or hit me up on Instagram or just write them down in the comments below. Um, yes, it's worth it. Y'all see it. <laughs> so, yeah, man. Uh, just subscribe, man. Subscribe, like the video. You know what I'm saying? Kill this video like I killed the last tire lettering video. And uh, we going up, baby. You know what I'm saying? The grind don't stop, baby. Yeah! I'm not going to